it's no news now when you record on vmix the video size is actually really really large if you take a look at my screen over here i recorded a video on the 1st of june 2025 and if you see the size it's actually 1.62 gig the length is just 28 minutes 28 minutes for 1.62 gig that's crazy so in this video, I'm going to show you a particular software I use to compress my videos the same quality, we're keeping the same quality, but just the size reducing, really compressing it to a lower size. Stay tuned in this video, don't forget my name, Joseph Olasikomi. This is Extensivo. If you are new to this video, please hit the subscribe button. Okay, so let's just dive straight into it. The software I use is called Handbrake. So we're just gonna first download Handbrake first of all. Handbrake is actually free to download. Just go to Handbrake download. It's free to download, free to download, not paid, nothing, nothing, just free. Click on the handbrake.fr um, over here. Then as you see it, for Windows 10 and later, that's for Windows 10, Windows 11, this for Mac, this for Linux, this for others. So just click on this and we're gonna download the um exe installer and break your yeah, file name this is this, this, that, that that's 23 mb not that much and it's downloading actually so it should automatically download our and break all right so once you download it just click on it and install like if you install any other software you're using and once that is installed let's go straight into it this is how your and break will actually look like you can choose a particular folder that is um videos with multiple files if you want to compress all of them in that particular file or if you just want to um select a particular video this is over here so you can just select this from here or you can just drag and drop i prefer dragging and dropping so we're going to go to where our video is saved in and you know in vmix when you record it's saved in document vmix storage except you've changed this one the desktop vmix storage this is not the one i want to do this is the one i want to do which is 1.6 so so you drag it and drop in and break drop over here then it scans it this is the video it's a particular um prayer session in church i usually used to record my prayer session in church so i can post it out for the church on telegram and on other platforms so normally you should just click start encode and it just start compressing but um you can change the presets if you don't have maybe if your video is not 1080 30 um fps if you want all that did by default it will be 1080 30 but if your video is 720 this is over here if your video is 4k if your video is this you can click all that's awesome if you want it very fast for 4k it's over here you can actually check all that also look at it for android and stuff but i would advise you to just use this the default that is fast 1080 fast 1080 default yes then if you want to your, your video if you want to compress also if you want to increase the quality you can increase it the higher it is the higher quality to be if you want to reduce you can reduce it the lower it is the lower the quality and the lower the size actually so just leave it as default which is usually in 22 by default yes by default it's in 22 which is actually really good the only time i actually reduce it is just maybe if you want to post to youtube and i know that there's a copyright song on the particular video i just compress it to the lowest then i post on youtube make it unlisted so that i can actually see what particular part is being copyrighted and i can fix that particular part because if i compress it to the lowest it can just be like 200 mb it can be like 10 mb be really small but the quality will be real bad so i just compress it that way so i can just see where and where i need to fix to re-edit to change the music that is copyrighted and then i come back here and change it back to 22 so i can encode this is the frame rate if you don't change to 60 you can change to 60 my video is in uh 30 actually my video is in 25p so don't leave it in 25p if it's one of my videos for youtube i'm going to put it in 60 because i record in 60 fps for 1080 but since this one is just 25 don't just leave it at 30 25 and 30 not much of a difference right then if you want audio also if you want to change, uh, put subtitles if you want to add subtitles to it if you want other things you can filter it there are a lot of things you can do with this particular app then you click on start encoding it's going to start encoding prepare to encode and you see it here this is how many minutes it has used how many seconds minutes are and this is the time remaining for it to complete encoding for it to complete compression so we're going to wait for it for it to compress and i'm going to show you how that is going to be done all right as it's compressed if you want to join my whatsapp group chat you can click on the join button beside the subscribe button after you subscribe you'll see join if you click on join check the particular package that has the whatsapp link once you join that particular package you'll see the link to the whatsapp and you can join the group chat yes all right it's compressed let's go check it out guys so in vmix storage over here which we have recorded on vmix is actually um 1.62 gig 
28 minutes 38 seconds 1.62 gig all right so in handbrake whenever you compress usually by default saving it in videos just in your videos here so if you cheat over here you'll see it's here 566 mb length 28 38 so it's still maintain the same the same video length it didn't cut anything off and the same um quality of video which is now 566 mb so it's got it in more than half um 1.68 gig I think half of it will be like 800 MB or so. So this, it cuts it down more than half size. More than half size, guys. It cuts it down more than half size, guys. Retaining the same quality of video. So thank you very much for watching. Don't forget, my name is Joseph Lasso Company. If this video has been very useful to you, please don't hesitate to like this video. I know I speak fast a, a bit, so you can actually go to the settings of this video. Just click on the settings plug over there. If you're in the phone, you see the settings plug up there. Click on it. Check, change the playback speed to 0.5, 0 0.8. .0. Just make it lower than 1.0. If you're in the system to view it, you see the settings icon down there. Click on it. Change the playback speed to a bit lower, so you can actually hear me slower. Thank you very much for watching once again. Um, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. See you in my next video.